All right, guys, can you say I have a lot of knives laying in front of me? Ready? I have a lot of knives laying in front of me. No lie. This company sent me the, it's a 2 it's T-U-O cutlery. Okay? So they sent me the regular version, and then they sent me the, um, the elite version. They sent me two sets in one box. So I'm going to start with this. Um, and then we're going to, then we'll try out the elite series. I'm really excited. This is like this elite series made out of Damascus steel. We'll show you in another video. We'll, we'll try it out. We'll get up close, but today we're going to cut with these. This is the regular 2 This is like for everyday kitchen. This is like people who are really like in the like professional cutting and everything. Okay. So come on in close and we can take a look at it. And, um, I don't know if you know the last set. Thank you so much for whoever sent me that last set. It was in a nice block. It had everything, but the problem was the edge of the knives went dull very fast. So I don't highly recommend the other set. Um, so that's why we're moving on because the other set lost its sharpness and we're looking for, for knives that keep their sharpness. Okay. So let's take a close up look at this block. This is a great knife block too. All right, come on in close. Okay, so the Ring series, the more expensive, it's a little bit more expensive. It's about $100 more than the regular Kitchen series, all right? So the 2 Cutlery, the 2 Ring series, we'll be doing next. But right now, I'm going to start working with these. You guys ready? Do you like this knife block or what? So this knife set has, it's got the Santoku. It goes right in there. It's got the cleaver, got the honing steel. Got a kind of a smaller cleaver right here. It's on the back side of the cleaver. Okay, and then it's got an all utility knife. Of course, your paring knife, which the paring knife usually is what you grab when you're gonna open, cut the tape and open packages and stuff. And then you have the kitchen shears. This is so important. You'll use these probably more than anything to cut bags open, to uh, just cut chicken apart, to spatchcock a chicken. These shears are important. But only, um, think about only using these for food items, okay? But always wash these constantly. You want your shears to be clean, okay? You got the nice knife block. So really it's a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's kind of, a, it's an eight piece set. So that's what we're gonna be using on the show right now. It's called 2 Cutlery, T-U-O Cutlery. Thank you guys for sending it. And I'll have links down below so you can pick up a set if you want, all right? So that's what we're using on the show. Let's try it out on a few field items. You guys ready? All right, so first we're gonna try and slice as thinly as possible with the all-purpose knife like you do on a regular tomato. This one's a little bit ripe. The outside's got some really soft spots. So we're gonna do some nice thin cuts. It looks like it's hanging up a little bit. Is it hanging up on you? Mm -hmm. No? Okay. For safety reasons, I'm having Tammy do the cutting. Okay, now we're gonna try the shears. We're gonna make a bunch of cuts on the celery. See how well it cuts through all the way. Try to open it up as much as you can. There we go. Like if you're making a salad. There you go, and then slide your, there it is, look at that. Look how soft and smooth. You'd think that celery was made out of butter. Mm -hmm. So now we are cutting the carrot which is a lot more firm and it's still having no trouble. This is the bigger cleaver that they give you from the set and it's having no trouble cutting through. Okay, it's time to do an onion with the Santoku. This is the one we're gonna do our pineapple experiment with, this knife right here. Look at how nice that cuts onions. That is beautiful. Are you guys ready? Every time we do a knife video since the beginning of time, We've, we've cut a pineapple in midair and the knives usually go through it. So I'm going to try this right now. Unfortunately, I don't have, did you notice what the, what the set was lacking? It had two cleavers. It was missing a chef knife, what I usually do this with. So I'm using the Santoku. Would you stop spitting? That drives me nuts. Okay, so I'm using the Santoku knife to cut this. Are you guys ready? All right, let's see if I can go through it. It may not be long enough. I'm not making excuses, I'm just saying. Here we go. Ha! 
<laughs> it worked. All my pots and pans are swaying, but it worked. Look at that. Right there, I went right through it. Nice cut. All right, I gotta go, oh, the pineapple lander right there. You can see where all the juice is. All right, I have to go clean up. I will see you guys in the next episode. It's 2-0 cutlery is what we're using on the show right now. I love you. Take care. Bye-bye.